Now at 6, nearly 500 empty apartments just north of downtown Fort Wayne may be getting a new lease on life. Good evening. I'm Heather Heron. Mark has the night off. There have been many attempts to renovate the St. Liver Village apartments over the last few years, but none of them successful. Well, now one local real estate broker believes he has the recipe to spice up this once thriving neighborhood. News Channel 15's Lamar Holiday is here to tell us what he plans to do. Lamar? Heather, Zach Boningham has faith in this five decade old apartment complex. That's why he's relying on certain type of funding to help renovate these apartments that have now become an eyesore. Lighted up windows, locked doors, vacant apartments. This is what you're greeted with when you pull into the St. Liver Village Apartments. This place was luxury living when it was built, and uh, up until about the last 15 years, it was a great place to live. But this once luxurious place has lost its luster over the years. Zach Badahum is a local real estate broker and says this property was eventually turned into Section 8 government housing, which is one of the reasons why the property has been left abandoned. And they're just really secure, well-built buildings, and uh, it's a shame to see anybody want to tear them down or to have them be vacant like this. There were attempts to get state and federal funding to renovate this property, but that fell through. And the city doesn't have the money to tear it down, so the owners is selling the property for $3.5 million. And Bonahum believes there's only one more way to save this complex. I think there will be issues getting private funding, but I think it's the only, I think it's the last resort. I think it's the only thing that will work now. Bada whom currently has donations coming in. To find out how you can help, click on this story on Wayne.com. In Studio 15 tonight, Lamar Holiday, News Channel 15.